and mics on mute. Vivek, Swayam, please keep your cameras on. Diksha, Shreshta, all of you, please keep your cameras on. We'll start with the prayer. I'm um, Vivek, you there? Uh, I mean, Vivan, sorry. Vivan. Priram. Jai Ram. Keep your camera on, Vivan. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram, everyone. So, um, everyone, please sit straight. So, today's prayer, um, Vivan will do. Okay. So, Vivan, give everyone some brief instructions on how they should sit and ask them to close their eyes. Okay. Make them relax a bit. Try yourself, okay? And then start a prayer. And before you make them open their eyes, make them rub their palms and place their palms and cup, your, cup their eyes and slowly, gently let them open their eyes with, with a beautiful okay. smile, okay? You have to give all the instructions which I generally give in the class. So um, if you forget something, it's totally fine, but try to give as many as you can. Okay, Vivan? Okay. Okay, so everyone please listen to Ivan, just follow his instructions. Hi right, Ivan. Close your eyes gently. And then Om Pur Purva Tatvai Tur Varenyam Purko Deva Sadimahi Deo Yona Prachatayad Now put your palm, put your palms in your face, and then slowly, gently put it put it down. And now open your eyes. Thank you, Vivan. Everyone, please have a beautiful smile on your faces too. Very good, Vivan. That was wonderful. Um, so just a small tweak. So every time um, when you place your palms on your eyes or your face, always rub it. Why do we rub it? We generate a lot of energy. So all the energy in our body, we are you know, providing it into to our entire body. We generate heat and energy with our palms and circulate it in our body, all the positive one. That's why we rub our palms every time. Okay. All right. Thanks for submitting your homeworks. Everyone, I have provided you the necessary uh, comments on your homeworks. Um, just a bit of request to everyone. So please make sure that you write it beautifully um, on your answer sheets. Some of the answer sheets are so difficult. We can hardly understand what you have written. And I, I bet you can't even read it. So um, that's a request. Just make sure you, you know, add some space between each letters or alphabets you write down on your sheets. Have some space between each line mm -hmm. as well, mm -hmm. um, because it it's very difficult to understand, read, and the words you write looks pretty bad sometimes. Okay. And whenever you write a word mala, uh, don't write it continuously. Always add spaces like her to na. That would be one line. Cha chu cha tu na that would be another line. Then ta tu na another line. Ta ta tha tha na ta tu na that would be another line. So you have to write line by line, not exactly in the same line. Okay. So write it in that way. Plus I have noticed like many of you are not able to, um, you know, create or make the right uh, letters properly, the vowels as well as the consonants. When I talk about E, it's not exactly what you, um, you know, see um, on the screen, which uh, which I pr present to you or in general. So it looks something else. It's not E. It doesn't look like an E. Sometimes your dha and gha, it's very confusing. You sometimes miss the alphabets too, like no, sure. So please don't do that. You've been practicing the word mala in the beginner um, section as well, in the classes as well. So the expectation here is that you at least know the entire word mala by heart and even know how to write it down. If you have an issue, 
uh, with you know how you are supposed to design that particular alphabet all together you can always you know raise your hands and let us know we'll try to correct it for you we do not provide you templates because you don't need it you are good with your sheets you can always you know write down the entire word mala in the sheet um also those who have not submitted your, their homeworks please um submit them duly okay um, not before the class um and today we will first have a small oral test with each of you you have to tell the entire word mala as we already discussed and then we will move to the other parts okay i will show you this show you my screen so that you can revise it one last time and uh, then during your oral test you cannot see anywhere no sources allowed okay let me share my screen um peter ne no plane no chhe the nahi karvano chhe ena plane no etle e push karo ke fight thagi push kari apne am am to ke rather than that apne cancel kari diya je ene kidu ke ke so ke if you push back till then this is a a e to e u अवेलेबल ला व श शा स ह क्ष त्र ग्य आई एम सो आई एम डोंट राइट इट कॉन्टिन्युअसली आई हैव सीन यू राइटिंग इट कॉन्टिन्युअसली सो यू सी हाउ वी वी हैव रिटन इट क टू ग्य ओके सो इन वन लाइन जस्ट दीज अल्फाबेट्स वुड बी देयर एंड इट्स फॉर एवरीवन एल्स टू सो हुएवर इज राइटिंग कॉन्टिन्युअसली विद कॉमास डोंट पुट एनी कॉमास so write it like this you don't have to uh, you know make the boundaries you just like in one line just four to five these alphabets would be there okay you don't write, you did you don't need to write anything in english just the hindi should be fine okay guys so you have seen it on your screen i'm going to stop my screen share and then you have to recite the entire word mala the swar as well as the vyanjan okay one after the other you cannot use any sources if you take any halt in between that's when i am going to cut you in and the other person will start the word mala and you know you have to practice it again and you're not doing or performing well okay so don't be disheartened but if you're not if you're going to take too much time on that i'm going to ask the other person to complete it okay all right let's start with okay kaira Yes, Kaira. Unmute yourself and tell us the entire word mala. Okay. A, H, G, G, R, J, J, G, G, R, J. Next. What next? Good job, Ben. Do you know the um, vowels? Uh, yeah. Can you tell us a to a? Oh, okay. A, 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 e, 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 a. A. Try yeah, try to complete. Yeah. O. O. E. E. 
Okay. Thank you so much, Kaira. You can mute yourself. That was a good attempt, Kaira. Since you were not there in the last class, but you have tried it well. Um. So next, can I? But you have to practice. Okay, keep practicing. You know, like uh, you you know, you just didn't go as per the en entire sequence, and you have to complete uh, curve to gya also. Okay, but practice it. Okay, not an issue. Next, can I have Ria Sood? Ria, the vowels, please. Ah, ah, e, e, u, u, a, r. And ah. Okay. Can you go to the consonants now? Can we do the consonants now? Ah, uh, ka, ka. Okay, no problem. You can mute yourself. Thank you, Ria, for trying. So again, there was an issue with the vowels. As you might already have noticed, right? It's a, a, e, e, u, u, a, i, o, a, u, um, aha. So after uh, a, you you know there was some I think something you just uh, were not able to complete it, but it's okay. It's fine for now. Practice it, okay? And go uh, to cha. You completed two lines. That's good. Um, but try to complete the rest also. So during your homeworks, try to, um, you know, whenever you're writing it, try to pronounce it as well. So whenever you're writing it, say it out loud each line. That's how you're going to learn it. Okay. But overall, a nice try. Aja. Uh, I, E, U, A, I, O, um, uh -huh. Okay, and the consonants? Ka, ka, ga, ga, ja, cha, da, 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 ta. It's okay. It's okay, Aja. You can mute yourself. Um, again, Aja. Um, I think you need to practice a little more on the vowels part. Um, towards the end, there was a glitch. Okay, you can probably correct it while you practice. And uh, regarding the consonants, you already you know the consonants. I can understand you. You all, all of you know the consonants, but it has to be in a particular sequence, like ka, ka, ga, ga, na, cha, cha, ja, ja, na, ta, ta, da, da, na. Like you do A B C D, A B C D E F G. H I J K L M N O P. It's in a sequence, right? Accordingly, um, there's a sequence in Hindi also for the alphabets. So you have to write, uh, you know, go ask for the sequence. For now, it's okay. Practice it. Practice more, okay? Um, next, can I have Streshta? Vowels, please. A I E E O O A I O O M A H. Um, consonants are ka ka ga ga na cha cha ja ja na ta ta da da na ta ta da da na ba fa ba ba ma ya ra la va she sha sa ha cha tra gya. Good, very good, very good. So, uh, guys, it has to be exactly like this. She did that, you know, exactly in a sequence. So try to practice it in that sequence. You will learn it eventually. So, um, and others, um, as the other person is saying it, keep practicing it once your turn comes. So you will at least know the entire vowels properly. I'm not, the expectation is you should know what you're saying at least. Okay. Next is why I'm. Oh, oh, um, uh -huh. Good. Consonants? 
क ख क घ न च छ ज ज न ट ठ ड ध न त थ ड ध न प फ ब भ म य र ल व स श स ह क्ष त्र ग्य गुड नाइस अटेम्प्ट स्वयं ओके ना कैन आई हैव विवान ओ आर ई ई ओ ओ ए ए ओ ओ अन अन गुड कंसोनेंट्स ओ को 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 नो जो 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 नो तो 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 नो तो 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 नो it's okay everyone it's okay but you did try well so a couple of um you know lines were good um you did a, there was a um, miss between na and na at one of the lines but please practice it your vowels were good okay we want practice it next can i have riya riya patel okay a a e e o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o on aha and then ka ka ga ga na cha cha ja ja na ta ta ja na da da na ta ta da da na pa 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 ba ma ya ra ya दीक्षा Um, Can you switch on your camera, please? Yeah, I did. Okay. Yeah. So, um, vowels. Um, a a e e u u a i o o um a h. And consonants. K k g g n. T t j j n. Um, t t d d n. T t t d d n. प फ ब भ म य र ल व श श स ह आई डोंट नो द रेस्ट ह ओ या ह श त्र एन The last one. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Again, you have to practice. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, did I miss anyone? Avika. I think I missed Avika. Avika, can you switch on your camera? Can you hear Avika? me? I can hear you. Yeah. Okay. A A E E U U A A O O M E E H. The consonants too. Yes. K K G G. Ah. K K G G. Ch. Ch. Ja, ja, ja. 
Um. The. The the. And. Uh, it's okay. It's okay, Abega. You need to practice, okay? Okay. Even your vowels, uh, you need to practice the vowels as well as the consonants. So did I miss anyone? No one? Okay, so guys, um, just a generic remarks, all of you. I know when you guys are looking at your pages, okay? So it isn't that I won't know when your eyes are rolling here and there. I know it. The thing is you should know it or you should by heart the vowels and consonants, okay? I'm not saying anything, um, even if you're using your pages or homeworks right now, because you're still practicing. But in the next class, you have a test. Wherein, um, obviously, maybe I'll ask you to blind for yourself, yourselves and then say the entire vowels and the consonants. And then, then I'm going to give you marks. Right now, you can see on your screens or homeworks, keep it beside you. I know how it is done. OK. So. Just practice it. You, you guys are submitting your homeworks, but it's important that you understand your homework more. You buy heart it, you learn the alphabets. There's no going back from that, okay? So, um, but a nice try, nice attempt. All those who were absent, they did try well. I'm really happy with that. And you're submitting your homeworks on time. Even that's good. So now we are going to practice so e ki matra wale shabd. Can anyone tell me what did we cover in the last class? Just unmute yourself and tell me. If the you remember. Amata. Yes, last time guys, we completed a matra wale shabd. And in this today's class, we are going to do e matra wale shabd. Uh, I'm just give, telling you your homework. What is your homework uh, for this week? You have to write the entire word mala. OK, because in the next class you have a test. Um, then today we are covering e matra wale shabd. So again, you will be writing down or you will bring as 10 different words with e matra. I will show you um, my slides and uh, but that's your homework. You can note it down. Share my screen real quick. Can everyone see the screen? OK, good. In the last class, what we saw um, was that we are adding matras now to each alphabet and we are forming different words. We have already covered, like I think most of you attended the classes in which we have we formed words without having any matras. We called them as a matrik shabd. OK, but these are matrik shabd, like these uh, shabd as in word, these words have matras involved. You've already covered the matra of a big a, okay, bada a in the last class. Today we are covering small e, choti e. So when I talk about e, this e, um, the matra involved is choti e like this. This is the matra. What exactly is this? This design which you see it means some word will be there. This matra will be on some word. So whenever you are writing your homework, don't make these designs. OK, you should just mention it like this. Don't make this design, not at all. OK. So this is E. So whenever we are going to add it to any of the consonant like this, it becomes something like this. OK. OK, now let us start with the uh, Vivan, Vivan, will you try? Will you try the first one for us? What it is? How you will read this? Unmute yourself, Vivan. And what is this? E. Yeah. Konsa e. e again? Which E? Uh, smaller E. Smaller E. OK, this, what is this? The. The. The plus E becomes? The. D. E. Plus, what is this? No. 
Din. Din. Din means? Sun. No. Din means day. There is sun. a sun, but yeah. Din means day. Can anyone tell me what day means din? So what does night means in Hindi? Unmute yourself, guys. Jisko bhi aata hai, unmute yourself and tell me. Don't Rat. raise your hand. Rat. Correct. If day means din, night means raat. If you don't know it, note it down in your notebooks, okay? It's good to have a little bit vocabulary added like this. Day means din, night means raat. Going to the next one. Aja. Yes, Aja. Uh, Ra plus va plus e. Uh, re. Eve. Okay, what is this? Okay, combine this now. E. Yes. Now combine this and this. No, you, you tell me what is this, okay? The one which I've circled. Ra. And what is this? V. Now tell me what it will become. Ravi. Ravi. Correct. It becomes Ravi. So don't add re. E matra is added only on va. Okay? So it becomes Ravi. What do you mean by Ravi? Uh, name. Yes. Ravi could be a name of any guy. Okay, this is some random guy. And Ravi also means? Uh, son. Correct. Guys, Ravi means son. And Ravi could also be a name of any person. Note it down. Note it down. So when you talk about synonyms, one, one word can have multiple meanings. And here it's a classic example. Ravi means son. Ravi means it could be the name of a guy. Next, can I have Rhea Patel? E plus fa, not fa, fa plus ra is ri. Okay, what is this? Sorry. What is this? P. Okay. Okay, okay. Try, try. What is this? Come. E. Collectively. Oh. P. Fee. Correct. This is fee. And this is? Ri. Mira. Ra. Now combine the sounds. Mira. Mira. Correct. Fir. This is fir. Just focus on combining their sounds. You know the matras. Combine the sounds. Fir. This is verb with having which has a matra of e. So it becomes fi. Now fi plus ra. Fi ra. Fi, ra, fir. Okay. Okay, Ria, can you try one thing? Let me. Okay. Just exactly the way we did right now. Okay. Um, what's this? Okay. Now, what is it? Ka. What is this? Calm. Calm. Okay. What is this? Sha. Sha. Sham. Good. Now. Sha. Kill in 
chill so chill <laughs> okay so that's chill so guys the way we are practicing it it's for you to okay what do you mean by fear fear means like to see you again like fear means again fear means again i'll see you again main aap se fir se milunga okay fear fear means again okay now can i have riya sood yes riya so va e kavi yes who's a kavi i don't know okay kavi means guys anyone knows who is a kavi and a writer author okay we have some answers like writer author anything else okay what is this guy doing can anyone tell me poet? hmm is it a poet it's a poet so this guy is a poet kavi means poet writer means lekhak okay you can write writer means lekhak poet means kavi just give me a moment this one is difficult okay shreshta un unmute yourself and switch on your camera yeah b plus ch plus a plus r b char vichar 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 means um thoughts vichar means thought so how we combined it v e matra plus v so e matra is on v so it becomes v then we have a word ch then we have a matra with ch so it become vicha then we have r so it becomes vichar yeah okay guys i'm just trying to make it simpler for you how you actually say it like this next can i have vichar means thought please wrote, note it down in your notebooks vichar meaning of vichar thought next can i have shreshta done okay kaira Yes, Kaira. Do it exactly in the same way, okay? What's this, Kaira? Ah. Huh? Hmm. Sh. Good. Then. E. No. Okay. This E matra is on which consonant? On this or on this? No. Correct. So, now Sh plus this becomes. e hmm e e then this is na sh plus e e is on nots then what what it becomes see here on your screen baba e what is this she mm -mm, no let's try again okay let's try again <clears throat> Okay, this is sh. Sh. This is na. No. Now this is e. E or na? What it is? What is this? If you combine this, ni. Correct. What is this? Ba. What is this? A. i is on which consonant r it is on r or it is on v v correct so this becomes v correct now what is this r now combine this combine this together r शनि 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 दिस दिस इज इज आर आर ओके 
शनिवार 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 मीन्स सैटरडे यस शनिवार मीन्स सैटरडे so guys you seeing on your screens how i'm trying to combine the words if it's difficult to understand i'm also writing it in english just so we can combine them easily to form a meaningful word you won't need this once you know the consonants properly okay shanivar means saturday okay can anyone tell me what is the hindi of monday monday ko hindi mein kya kehte hain anyone knows शनिवार मीन्स सैटरडे लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दिस मंडे ट्यूजडे वेटनसडे थर्सडे Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Saturday you already know. Monday. Monday means Somvar. Somvar. Please note it down on your in your notebooks. Days of the week. Okay. Somvar. This one. Next is what um, Shreesta said. What was that Shreesta which you said? Uh, Mangalvar. Mangalvar. So Mang. Gal. The matra is behind. So like that. That's what I said. This hmm. goes to ma. Mangalvar. So am matra. Am matra is on ma. Mang. Then ga, la, then va, va has a matter of a, then ra. Mangal var. Mangal var means Tuesday. Note it down, guys. Next Thursday. Next is Wednesday. Is it Budhwar? Yes. Can anyone tell me how to write Budhwar? Tell me. I will just write it down. How do we start it? Is it B with the bada u matra? It's not Budhwar, no. It's Budhwar. Budhwar. Chota you see, chota u. Correct. Bu. Then what? What's the other one? Other consonant? Mm. Hmm. The. Correct. The next. Ba with a matra. Correct. The next. Ra. Correct. Perfect, guys. So after every every day, you add this word var. Okay, it will be there everywhere. Just the starting uh, alphabets change. So Wednesday means Budhwar. Okay, now let's talk about Thursday. Can anyone tell me what's Thursday in Hindi? Gurvar or is that Gujarati? It's okay. Yeah, it say it again. Gurvar. Okay, in Gujarati you you say Guruvar. Okay, in Hindi we say Guruvar. Okay. Okay. Can you tell me what's the first consonant? What will be the Ga. first consonant? Huh? Ga. Ga. Um. छोटा This is chota u, and how do I write bada u? Bada u. Chota u means 
छोटा ऊ बड़ा ऊ यू सी द डिफरेंस दिस इज छोटा ऊ वॉट्स द नेक्स्ट कॉन्सनेट विथ मात्रा करेक्ट देन यू गॉड इट इट्स गुरुवार Guys, you're writing it, right? I'm assuming you're writing it. I'm going to ask uh, the days of the week in next class. So that's why I'm making you write it. That's why I'm putting down a lot of efforts here on the screen. So my writing may not be perfect because I'm using a pen right on my screen. So I'm not writing in my notebook. Okay. So, but you have to write it properly. Part of your homework: write the name of the week. Next is Friday. Can anyone tell me? What's Shukravar. Friday in? Hmm. Shukravar. How do you write it? Ah. Uh, Sha with the chota ko. Which Sha? Uh, the one that has the loop and the. Okay. But. Okay. Shukravar. Then which U matra? Chota. Chota U. Then. Then Kha. Kha. then uh oh. this is kra kra shukra shukravar okay okay guys just write it like this for now so you write a k first then write exactly here you like write a, you know just elongate like this so this is read as r So with a k, just add something like this. Becomes Shukra Bar. Should I rub everything? Write it again. Shukra Bar. Even if I'm not writing it properly, because you know you've heard it, Shukra Bar. You can always form the word up on your own. Shu, sh with u, kra, write k plus r. Then var, you already know how to write var. I'm going to wipe everything on my screen. Shani var, it's there on your screen, okay? Shani var. Shani var means Saturday. It's already there. You can write it from here. Shani var. Last is Sunday. Sunday. Sun. day means day of the sun Ravi day Ravi. means yes day means var and i already told you different names of sun so one we, which we just did was ravi so it's ravi var ravi that so will be ravi var okay like ravi var Okay, guys. Everyone has noted all the days of the week. Write it down. Take your time. Once you are done, just raise your hand. Which one is Wednesday? Wednesday. This one. Wednesday. Tuesday, Friday, Saturday. This is obviously Sunday. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Wait, 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 wait. Tuesday. Okay. Wednesday. Sorry about that. No, you're good. Um, this is Friday. Thank you. Okay. All good. Everyone, Kaira, you've done. No, write it fast, fast, fast. If you've missed it, I'll send it to you again. Okay, in the Teams channel. Yes, good, Vivan. Good. Write it as per your understanding in English as well as in Hindi. I've written M O N T T U E just to make you understand. It's Tuesday and it's Monday. You can write entirely M O N D A Y Monday. So day means var. 
Thank you, Avika. Uh, day means var. So you are adding var with every other uh, you know, day of the week. Just the starting one changes. Either it's somvar, it's mangalvar, budhvar, shukravar, guruvar. Okay, var is always there. Var means day. Everyone done? Riya Patel, you still writing? Okay, finish, finish, finish. Aja, did you do? Okay, Diksha, completed? Okay, Shukravar. Your Shukravar, your sure doesn't seem fine to me. Check again. It looks like sir. Show me again, Diksha. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Yes, Diksha in your sh uh, Shuk Guruvar. Okay, you know which day is what? In Shukravar, you have added it like sir. You, it's sure and sir. See, um, it's just for Diksha. Diksha, you have written like this. Like this. Why, why is there a line like this? Do you see any line here? But in your notebook, it is there. So don't add any line here, okay? It is Sha with Uki Matra only. Um, Aja, Riya, done. I will send it to you guys if you have not done. Okay, let me check one by one, okay? What is... Okay, I am checking... So it's not visible properly. So it's not visible properly. It's very light, very light. Okay, Vivan. Vivan, bring it closer. You are vanishing, Vivan. Okay. Somvar, Mangalvar, Budhvar, Shanivar, Vichar. Okay, Swayam. Swayam, it's good. Okay. Now, Vivan. Vivan, bring it in front of the camera or you can send me a picture because I cannot see you now. Okay. So, I will correct it, guys. Or do one thing. So click a picture. And after the class, send it to me. Guruvar, sh Shukravar, it's Shukravar. Diksha, it's Shukravar. U matra should be there with the sh, not Shukravar. So guys, um, what I'll do, I'll send you the entire list of the days of the week. You can correct it in your notebooks, okay? So I'm going, I'm moving forward. Thank you, Vivan. Thank you, Vivan. Yeah, I'll, I'll check it, Vivan, again, okay? Send it to me in Teams channel. Because, uh, because some of you are using pen, I can read it. Some of you are using pencils. It's very difficult to read. We're moving ahead, guys, okay? I'm changing the slide now. Those who have not written, I'll send it to you and you can write it down in your notebooks. Next, can I have Swayam? Swayam? E plus nani equals... Sorry, this is... Sorry, sorry, this is plus. Plus... Sh plus a ni plus sha plus na nishan. Correct. Sha nishan means mar a mark. Yes. For example, this is a mark. When someone beats you, you get a mark. Um, you have a lot of marks on your palm as well. Everything is called any kind of mark. We call it as nishan. Okay. Nishan. Sorry for this equal, guys. It's plus, okay? Nishan means mark. Okay, um, who didn't do it yet? Can you please raise your hand? Just on, on Teams, uh, don't raise it like this. Just uh, have your hands raised, like with the emoji one, okay? Diksha. Okay, so um, the plus a plus becomes the um, plus a becomes the the now this one e plus k equals k correct and ya plus a equals ya. So now read this together. So that would be da kia. Da kia. Da kia means. Um, postman. 
करेक्ट डाकिया मीन्स पोस्ट मैन यू कैन लोअर योर हैंड दीक्षा नाउ नेक्स्ट इज अविका Guys, you can always uh, why we discuss the meaning of each word so that you can write it down in your notebooks. It's gonna help you by for you know by increasing your uh, vocabulary. Okay. That means postman. So, Avika. Mm hmm. This one is easy, Avika. Ki. Ta. A. Ba. Kitab. Kitab means books. Kitab means books. Book, not books. Kitab means book. If I talk about kitabe, it becomes books. So it's singular and plural, guys. So right now I'm talking about a book. So it is a kitab. Upar wali kitab lekar aao. Bring the book which is at the top. The kitab means book next everyone completed the, you know these okay now i'll pick you at random okay um aja uh, e plus uh, da equals d na plus ka plus ra is Combine uh, okay, yeah. Combine up till this much. What is this? Thin. Thin. Okay. Now what is this? Car. Okay. Now say it together. Dinkar. Dinkar. Dinkar is again the meaning of sun. Sun is also known as Dinkar. And there could be a guy called Dinkar. Here he's. Uh, Ram Dhari Singh Dinkar is a very famous writer. So, but Dinkar could be a name of any guy. Plus, it also means sun. Okay, Dinkar. I'm moving, guys. Abhika, do you have any question? Oh no, I forgot to. It's okay. Okay, Ria, please read the first line. Ria Sood, and then second line, Ria Patel. First line by Ria Sood. E L A K I L A S K I L A S M E P A N I L E L E A L E Okay. Ria, what is this? L A Yes. Now, what is this? L A What is this? A. Who? If this is A, then what is this? The the one closest to the edge is A, and the one in the middle is O. This is O. So what is this? Le. Le. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's no A, no. There's only La. This this is La. La. Lau, lau, yes. Lau means to bring. Glass me, pani lau. Pani means water. Glass means a glass. Glass. Glass me, pani lau means to get or to bring. Glass me, pani lau. So what does it mean? Bring a glass of water. Bring a glass of water. Now Ria Patel. Aaj. Hmm. Ravi. Yes. Um. Some. What is this? This one. The second one. Pa. Mo. Which matra is there? O matra. Okay. If this is O matra, then what is this? Is it the first one? The A I matra. A matra, A matra, guys. A, not I. If it is I, it will be like this. If it is O, it will be like this. I and O, we add one more loop. In A, we add it right above the consonant. 
Okay, in O, we add a line. Then on that, we add this matra. Okay, difference between O and A. So, Aaj Kavi Samelan hai. Kavi means poet. Aaj means? Today. Today. Samelan means, uh, mm, like when, uh, it's, it's more like um, when people of the same kind of, uh, you know, get together. Samelan means kind of get together. So, Aaj Kavi Samelan hai. Kavi Samelan means, right, what kind of get together it is? Like a hangout kind of. Of, of whom? Kavi means poet. Can anyone poetry, tell me? Poetry get together? Yes, poetry get together. So all the poets get together. Poetry is Kavita. We are talking about Kavi. Kavi means poet. So it's a get together of all the poets. Aaj Kavi Sammelan hai. Next is uh, Swam. Swam, read the third line. Mere man mein ek vichar aya hai. Mere man mein ek vichar aya hai. Vichar means thought. Man means? Mind. Ek, man mein ek. Ek means? One. One. Vichar means thought. Aya hai means? Up like came. Came, arrived. So what does it mean? Mere man mein ek vichar aya hai. A thought came in my head. A thought mind. came in my head. Correct. In my mind. So not head exactly, it would be mind. Okay. Man means mind. Head means sir. Okay. You cannot see mind, you can see a head. So it's a metaphysical element, man. Next is Kaira. Read the fourth one. Ra. Ra. Va. Vi. Ravi. Ravi. Mm -hmm. Me, Mary, yes, Kitab, Kitab, Pa, Pad, Pad, correct, Ra, Ra, Ha, Ra, Ha, He, He, Ravi, Mary, Kitab, Pad, Raha, He, Who's Ravi? The name Ravi? of a, a name of a boy. Correct. Ravi, Mary Kitab. Mary Kitab means? My book. Correct. Ravi, then my book. Pad Raha hai means? Padna means read, guys. Okay? Padna means read. Ravi, Mary Kitab pad raha hai. Matlab? What does it mean? Ravi is reading my book. Okay. Next, can I have Ria Sud done, Ajar done, Kaira done, so I am done. Um, okay. Vivan. Did I cover you, Vivan? No? Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. We have two more minutes. Feel 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 Shanivar. Correct. Shanivar is Shanivar. Oh. Oh. This is a difficult one. I can help you with this. Kutti. Kutti hai. Ah, is Shanivar ko chutti hai? Chutti means? That's a favorite thing. That's your favorite thing. Chutti means? Okay, well, what do you have on Saturday, guys? Do you go to school on Saturday? Oh, day off. Day off. Chutti means holiday. Okay. Is Shanivar ko chutti hai? Is means this. Shanivar means Saturday. Chutti means? Day off, holiday. Hair means it is there. So what does it mean, Vivan? Is Shanivar ko chutti hai? Shanivar? Shanivar means Saturday, Baba. 
we did that no shaniwar means saturday it's a day off on saturday guys okay <laughs> next is uh, shreshta shreshta please see the sixth line it's already one yeah. so yeah do it quick um tab fir okay so this is this is like this this is written like this the first one oh. to 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 this is u matra baba tu um, tum tum a uh, tum tum se a uh, tum fir kab a ao ka aoge okay. Tum means you. Fir means um again. When are you gonna come again? When are you gonna come again? Kab means when. Aoge means to come. When are you gonna come again? Correct. Yeah. Um, Diksha. Uh huh. Yes, yeah, seventh one, seventh line. Okay. Chidiya. Chidiya. Um. Akash. Akash. me me ud 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 sorry um rahi rahi chidiya aakash mein ud rahi hai chidiya means um bird chidiya means bird aakash means sky sky ud rahi hai udna means fly yes chidiya aakash mein ud rahi hai means um a bird flew from the is sky is flying in the sky yeah yeah yeah, yeah. okay um avika last is avika avika read the third line oh, sorry ninth line va vi vikam vikas yes vikas that's a name of someone yes then आज ओके नेक्स्ट चला यस रहा है है सो दिस वर्ड अभी का व्हाट इज दिस स What is this? The. This is the. No ha. Then what is this? If this is ha, then what is this? Ha. How can both be ha's? This is e. E. What is this? Ki. Yes. What is this? La. What is this? Um, the. Kila. Combine. Kila ne. Kill. Kill. This is Sai. It is. Sai kill. Yes. Vikas at Sai kill chala raha hai. Vikas is. Vikas. I is riding a cycle today vikas at cycle chala raha hai okay mm-hmm. so i think um, all of you have done this guys so your homework is write entire word mala write 10 different words with e matra like this okay like we have done today e matra do not repeat the words which we have done in the class come up with something new so 10 words like this how we how we are combine it don't make this matra like this okay you can either write the entire word like this or you can add matra like this plus the consonant just an example don't write this dot 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 don't write that okay so write 10 different words and uh, in next class you will obviously i will again ask you the word mala until you are perfect at it and uh, the name the days of the week name of the days of the week in hindi all right guys um 
let's move ahead. It's already five. We are up by five minutes. So sorry about that. Um, let's do the closing prayer. All of you sit straight with your backs or your spines erect. Shoulders rolled back. Eyes gently closed. Hands in Namaskara Mudra. All of you, leave whatever you're doing. Just hands in Namaskara Mudra. Take a deep breath in and out. One second, take a deep breath in and out. Last time, take a deep breath in and out. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Niramayaha Sarve Bhatrani Pashyantu Ma Kaschitukha Bhagavad Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Everyone start rubbing your palms real quick. Up your eyes with your palms. Looking through the gap of your fingers, open your eyes with a beautiful smile on your faces. Jai Shri Ram, everyone. Please submit your homeworks by Thursday. Okay, don't submit it before the class. So you have ample amount of days. So by Thursday, please submit your work. If you have any questions or concerns, please post it on the channel. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Thank Jai you. Shri Thanks for joining. Jai, Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram.